Unbelievable. Femi Adeshino begs Nigerians not to abandon Muhammad Buhari. So you know that the man can be abandoned, yes? He said, well, why they cannot abandon him? And Nigerians as well should follow suit and not abandon Muhammad Buhari. I mean, if you listen to his statement, what could make a man to be abandoned? There are things that a man would have done that at the end of the day, people will say, you know what, to your tent, to Israel. And it will be strictly, and, you know, it will be strictly abandoned. And so Femi is saying Nigerians should not abandon Buhari. But why? Why? Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like or share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Special advisor to President Muhammad Buhari on media and publicity, Femi Adeshino, has described Buhari as a strict man with a kind heart. Adeshino, in a weekly article Friday with Adeshino, said, Buhari is kind and that is why some of us cannot abandon him, even in the face of crisis, and Nigerians must do the same, not abandon the president. They will really and only appreciate him after he's out of office. This man is doing the best for the country, but it's sad that Nigerians cannot see it. And that is why I'm appealing to Nigerians not to abandon him, but to be patient and see what this man is working at. According to the presidential spokesman, Nigerians who describe describe very well the criticism of the president are ignorant of the president's personality. Criticizing the president is not the way forward. They are really ignorant of what the president is, who he is and what he intends to do and what he's doing to ensure that Nigeria turns a new leaf. That is, as he said, let us not be quick to condemn what or who we don't know or understand. President Muhammad Buhari is strict on bending on certain issues, but wicked? No, not so. He should not be abandoned. In the days of Motana Mohammed as head of state, one senior military officer described him as a bully, a kind-hearted bully. Same with Buhari, not a bully, but a strict man with a kind heart. And I wish that Nigerians will open their eyes and see that is a strict man but has a kind heart, a man who does not forget to show kindness to both the living and the dead. That is Buhari for you. You now see why some of us have chosen to follow the president through thick and thin? Yes, there is a lot of challenges currently. There are a lot of issues going on, but we cannot abandon the president. And that is why I'm appealing to Nigerians not to do the same, to stay true with the president. Blessed, bless him, blessed be he of the Lord who has not left off his kindness to the living and the dead. That is how best I can describe Buhari, one who has a heart for both the living and the dead, who is sincere and wants to do something worthwhile for the nations, only if Nigerians can see it. So my wonderful people, this is really unfolding. Uh, the man is telling Nigerians to be kind to Buhari. Uh, Nigerians should please accept Buhari as he is and not go ahead and begin to castigate him or see him as a bad person, but rather Nigerians should open their hearts and receive Muhammad Buhari and they should not abandon him, not even at this time when the rains are falling and he's out there in the cold all by himself. He says, well, Buhari means well. Buhari has a large heart and that is why some of them cannot leave Buhari. And he also is encouraging Nigerians not to leave Buhari and that Nigerians should stay true to the course and stay with the president because, you know, the president is a man who has a large heart, who, you know, intends and mean well for Nigerians. So this is what is happening right now, my people. Uh, we are hearing that uh, Buhari means well. Yeah, we are hearing that Buhari means well. He may be a strict man, but he has a large heart. Maybe a man that is very strict, Okay, he's very, very strict, but his heart is really large and open and wants to, you know, support and do the best by the nation. But again, that is Femi Additional's perspective. But, I mean, if we say that, then what are we insinuating? Because if you are kind, if you are good, you don't tell me you are kind. You don't tell me you are good. I see it, I know it, and I can say he's a kind man. 
she's a kind woman. She's a good man. She's a good man. She's a good woman. So you don't come to tell me, I'm a, you don't know me, I'm a good man. No, no. Let me, there are some things you don't tell people. They get to find out. Or others can give attestation to who you are by what they know of you and what you have done for them. They are the ones now to convince others and to tell them that this is the real deal. Don't get it twisted. This person has a large heart. He or she is sincere. He means well. Blah, 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 blah. So you don't come to tell me that you are a kind person. You don't do that. How do I know? For all we know, talk is cheap. And nobody wants to tell the other person is a bad person. Unless it's trying to paint a picture. Or trying to be hard and all that. And that aside, most people want to be referred to or seen in a good light. And so you don't come to tell me you are a good person. Let me see. Let me experience. Let's have that position. Let, let's, let's have it together. Yeah, I can see indeed that you are a good person. You have a kind heart, a large one at that, and you're sincere. You're, you mean well. And let me discover for myself. So don't put it on my face. Don't come to tell me. So you are the one telling us now that Buhari is strict, but he has a large heart. Hmm. You will, we, he will have to prove that to us. Okay, he will have to prove, prove that to us. We have to see it for ourselves. We have to know it. We have to come, to come to terms with it if really that is who he is. That if really that is who he is. Because if you are telling us that this is who he is, then we should be able to really and sincerely see it. It should shine through. After all, he has been the president. Okay? He has the opportunity to show that he's a kind person. He has the opportunity to show that, you know, he has a large heart. So you telling us that that is who he is. You should have allowed us to discover for ourselves. You should have allowed us to find out for ourselves. So is it that you are trying to do right by him or you have a mission statement, you have something you want to portray, you want to convince us of at all means. Other than that, you don't have any business forcing it on us that um, he has a kind heart, he's a good man and we sh he should not be abandoned by Nigerians who cannot see what he's doing. He's doing something, they let, let us see it. Don't tell us what he's doing, let us see what he's doing. We heard enough of what he wants to do. 2015, we heard, we believed, and we supported. Here we are today. So let us see it for ourselves. Leave us a comment. Don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button. God bless you. Have a lovely day. Bye for now. Bye.